Hi there. Today, I want to do something a little bit different. I don't want to do a car trick as such. I'm only going to use cars just because I don't have a spectator and I need some random numbers picked, which I'm just going to use these cars for, but this is not a car trick. You can do this with just a spectator, a pen, piece of paper, and a calculator, which I don't have a calculator because in this day and age, everybody has telephones with a calculator built in it. It's like watches. Who has a watch in this day and age? All right, so, deck of cars now. I've took out all the jacks, queens and kings because we don't need them, we only need zero to nine. Okay, so tens would be zero, these would be zero, and these are obviously ones. Okay, so we can mix them up and I need complete random numbers. So I need a random three digit number from a spectator. So you can just say to the spectator, give me a three digit number with three different numbers in. Okay, so let's just say we've got three, a one, and a seven. So there's our first random number that the spectators just come up with. So we've got a three, a one, and a seven. Now I'm gonna be half fair with this trick, and I'm also gonna have a three, one, seven. Okay? Next, oh, before we go any further, let me just uh, do a little prediction. So we've got, let's just, uh, that there so that's going to stay there in view I'm not going to touch that okay so now you say to the spectator need another random three digit number but only this time I'm not going to be so fair because I'm going to have a random number as well so you mix up the cards you don't have to mix you can just say to the spectator get a random three digit number and they will tell you I don't have one so let's not have a zero first sorry you can have a zero first don't get me wrong so we've got a three, five, five. Okay, so we've got a three, five, five. So you've got two digits the same on the table. I might do the same just to make you a you know, six, four, four, why not? All right. So we've got those, we've got all our numbers. Spectators come up with those themselves and I've been half there with the top number, first one, and the, the bottom two we've come up with ourselves. All right, now we need our calculator. So we've got, uh, i unlock my phone first. There's my calculator. Okay, so we're gonna times these two numbers together and get an answer, and then times them two together and get an answer, obviously. All right, so three, one, seven, times three, five, five and that equals, just get this lids are a bit stiff on the pen. All right, so with this answer, we've come up with one, one, two, five, three, five. Okay, so that is what them two times together equals that. Okay, now we're gonna do this one here. So we've got three, one, seven times, Six four four. I thought I'd be funny and be clever. Just because you had two numbers the same, I thought I'd go for it as well. And that comes up with two zero four one four eight. Now, two numbers equals that. These two numbers equal that. So if we had them two together, so we've got plus one one two five three. Five that equals three one six six eight three. Okay, that is the answer we've come up with. Yeah, look at that, beautiful. That is the answer. Look at that. That's Ace of Spades uh, 1967 hashtag just giving me a message there, I'll read his in a minute. Let's just stick in there for now. Sorry, I'm not disregarding your message, I'll get back to it. So that's the answer we've got. That's the answer we've got from random numbers that the spectators come up with and myself. Before, I made this little prediction on here and the prediction I made on here is also 316683. And that was before we even come up with all the rest of the numbers. 
thank you very much and that is surprisingly a Harry Lorraine trick thank you very much